actually it's, it's quite a simple plot um, with a lot going on under it and above it and around it. It's uh, these twin brothers, 15 year old boys, Dominic and Pat, and their, um, their grandmother, um, she's had a stroke and she has uh, gone what we used to call senile. So, you know, she's forgotten really who she is and who other people are. And she accidentally burns their home down and they need to go stay in a summer cottage where they usually have these wonderfully wild and happy uh, summer holidays with their massive troop of cousins. And it's generally a very joyous thing. Um, but this time, of course, they're, they're very sad because they've lost their home and it's the winter time. And the cottage, which is usually full of life and uh, happiness for them, um, is empty and grey. And they themselves, because think about this, they're, they're 15. Um, and they have just had their eyes open to the fact, uh, uh, the brutal reality, that no matter how good you are or how kind you are, or how much you've followed the rules in your life. Everything you love can be gone like that. All, all, they've lost their life's work. Uh, they've lost everything that made them comfortable. And what this has done has, has broken them in a manner that really they, were too, they shouldn't really have ever been broken at that age. This understanding is too hard. And there's a little crack inside them now, this like little darkness inside them that for the first time ever makes them visible to the ghost that has been living in the holiday cottage for all their childhood. And the ghost that lives there suddenly recognises in them the hurt, the broken bit that it, it has too, the loss, and it thinks it's found a home it thinks it's found a friend, the thing that it's been searching for in it, its whole kind of supernatural existence. And it latches onto the brothers and things go from there.